Hi, I wanted to talk to you about this problem. It's where you have a poll. We have a sample of 1,763 adults. They tell us what the margin of error is, 2.5%, and we want to find the level of confidence. So in this problem, there's a video that talks you through it. This is the formula they're using. Margin of error equals, it's called Z alpha over two, all over two times the square root of n. So Z alpha two is like an X or a Y or a Z, it's just one thing. Two is just a number, n is n. So we're gonna take our 2.5 percentage points and change it to a decimal. So take 2.5 and divide it by 100 to get 0 0.025. The Z alpha over two stays, that two stays, and instead of putting N, we're going to take this 1,763 and put it here. And now we're gonna do some algebra or plug it into Desmos. Um, I will show you what to do on Desmos. So if you open up desmos.com, you're going to recall that to solve, we need to, multiply both sides by the bottom of the fraction. So we had, the way it was written is 0 0.025 equals, I'm just gonna type a Z, two times the square root of 1,763. So we're going to multiply both sides by this bottom of the fraction because when you do that, the top of the fraction and the bottom of the fraction are cancel. So the two divided by two is one, the square root divided by square root is one. So then we're left with 0 0.025 times that, and that's going to be equal to our Z. We're gonna round one decimal. So that gives us that our Z alpha over two is equal to 2.1. Now, now that we know what Z alpha over two is, we're gonna take our 2.1 and go to this davidmlane.com hyperstat backslash Z table. And we know, so what we want is between. So we take our 2.1 and a negative 2.1, and we want the area from a value, because we have the value. And we're gonna click recalculate, and so the area between 2.1 and negative 2.1 is 0.9643 or 96.43. And that is the level of confidence. It means we're about 96% confident that our poll will give us what actually happens. Let me know if you have any other questions. Thank you.